You're awake. Oh, dear. You're a damn idiot, you fuck. What are you doing? What? I told you to wake me up if you saw anything. You didn't do that. Look at the fucking arrow. Jeez. You're, you're an idiot. You could have died. Just, I can't keep this up. I'm getting stressed beyond belief. Every single time you put yourself in danger. I'm waking up with nightmares. That you're gonna die. And this does not help. I cannot keep doing this. Can we just please stop? We, we can go sell this book off. Give it to the clerics here. They can do this stuff. I cannot watch you keep hurting yourself. I, I just can't. I don't want to deal with that. I just want you not to kill yourself. I want to spend my life with you. <laughs> You're trying to shorten your own life. I don't want that to happen. Please. I know you don't mean to, but it's still stressful to me. I just... <sighs> I'm the one who is having to make sure that you're okay. I do not see it's killing me right now, watching you nearly die uh, like every week. It's stressful. It hurts. My heart can barely take it. But you. Don't you care about how I feel? You're being very selfish right now. It's, I'm sorry. That was very rude. I love you. And I just... I can't watch you keep doing this to yourself. I know, however, if you think you're fast enough to deal with some things, but when you're nearly dying and I can barely save you, I just can't. I just want to cry all the time. And you're just like a weak spot on me. I just don't want that to happen. I don't want you to go. I don't want you to leave. I don't want you to die. Can we just take like a vacation or break? We can buy a house in Ecoclaw. We are here already. We have the money to do it. We can Put a few hundred gold down to find a nice little... Too bad. Maybe we can get some kids in the future. <laughs> Shut up. God, you're such an idiot sometimes. <sighs> an idiot that I love. I know. I know. I know you like helping people. But I just like protecting you. And it's, I know it's getting in the way of what you would want to do, but I'm just hoping that you could, please, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I don't mean to be like this, I can be better, I swear. <sighs> yes, I said I love you. Because I do. I mean, it's not that hard to understand. Even for a dumbwit like you. I just hate it. So much. Maybe if we talk to this demigod. Thor. We can see if he has anything that we can use to help you. Because... I don't think your regular weapons are doing much to help you. Would you be okay wearing armor? That would help me a lot more. It would make my anxiety go down. I'm sorry. 
Of course, I have. I should apologize. I'm being mean to you. I'm mean to you all the time. I don't want that to be some of your last memories. I want them to be happy memories of us. I'm sorry. I am. Would you want me to apologize for apologizing too much? <laughs> want that I could just get you more angry? Here. I won't apologize. But I want you to know that I'm always sorry. Promise me that. And promise me you won't just keep getting yourself killed. This is ridiculous. Okay. I do love you a lot. I mean, this city is very nice and stuff, but if you don't want to be here, I will continue going out and adventuring with you. And I want to make sure you're safe and I want to be with you. And if we can maybe get a, like a country home, you know? <laughs> no, I don't want to be a... No, no, I'm not being a house husband like that. I, I just think it'd be nice to have a place like that. And we don't have to. But I can tell you, it'd sure make me happy if we had our own place together. That we can come back to. I mean, hell, Eagle Claw is a nice little center of the place. We could get a house here together and then store our stuff here. Get some horses. It, I think it'd be nice. Don't you? Well, I think we should. And it's just the two of us, so legally I am entitled to half the money. And since you are getting yourself killed all the time, I don't think you're in the right mind, so I get access to all the money now. <laughs> well, it's it's fair to me, because you're acting like an idiot all the time, and I hate it. So maybe if you weren't an idiot, we wouldn't have to deal with this. And maybe you could have some access to the money. Yeah. I'm going to go purchase us some food. What would you like to eat? Well, I can get you anything out there, really. Maybe I can go get us something nice, like a, a, a dinner, like, uh, like a date. You know? There's very nice restaurants out here. I can get us some clothes to wear. I really like to dress up for you, if you wouldn't mind. It would make me feel so much better to just have a nice little vacation like this. I heard that they have hot springs as well. So, maybe we can have some fun there. Get a nice dinner, go there, drink some wine, and then come back and rest. I'm sorry, I've been so mean to you. I don't want that to be our last memory. I want us to have happy memories together. And I just want you to understand that I... I care about you a lot, and I understand that it's hard for you to understand sometimes after I insult you and belittle you. I... that's how I show love. I just... I'm sorry. You just kiss me to shut me up. If you're gonna just kiss me to shut me up, you can actually kiss me good, alright? Like that. That's nice. You're beautiful, you know that, right? Not why you think like nah. Don't you smirk at me. I You're the one who's dumb. Mm. Yes, I'm grumpy. You're making me grumpy. And you're acting like an idiot sometimes. I'm I'm leaving now. Alright, I'm going to get the food, and then we can go deal with that. Alright? I know your measurements. I can give you this some nice clothes. I'll get us something matching. Maybe we can get our painting done. That'd be nice, wouldn't it? I mean, if you're okay with sitting still for an hour, you're always so jittery. So, yeah. Alright, um, I love you. I'll see you in a bit, okay? Get some rest. That is gonna kill you if you keep moving. I'll pick up a healing potion while I'm out. 